these two books we uh, use to talk about propaganda mm -hmm. and how people don't wake up one morning and decide to deport their neighbors. They actually learn to hate, and how is that done? Um, the first thing that's done is that information is limited or cut off so that the government can introduce their own information. And this book, when we open it up, you'll see a big red V in it because it was stamped verboten and scheduled to be burned. And that's the way they limited information back then. Now they cut off internet access or Facebook. In the, during the Holocaust, the bowl was one of the most important things someone had because they were, the food was soup like, and so if you didn't have a bowl, you died. And so this particular bowl has BMW stamped on it. And the reason that we use this artifact in our collection is that, and, and have curriculum around it, is because it speaks to the subject of corporate responsibility during the Holocaust. During this time, the Germans identified Jewish people by giving them the middle name of either Israel for a man or Sarah for a woman. So this man, whose name was Klaus Dom, was then Klaus Israel Dom, and that's how the German government identified Jews. And it was the Swiss government that asked the German government to put the big red J on so that uh, Jewish refugees wouldn't cross the Swiss border. And so we use this artifact and artifacts like this to talk about government responsibility and government bystanding in genocide.